Hey, what's up guys? This is a quick video to show you how to tether your T-Mobile Edge internet connection with your computer. And this is just for a visual because I'm in California right now. And I'm using the Edge to do blog posts and other stuff like that. Um, so it's really simple, but I just want to give you guys a visual to help out if someone doesn't get it. So I have the instructions on my blog, and as you can see they're right there, 1 through 10 basically. So what you're going to do is open up your Safari browser on your phone, and you're going to go to help.benm.at, and what you're going to do there is you're going to go to, scroll down and go to the first mobile configs and you're going to hit download, or click on it and you're going to select your country and then your carrier so if you're doing T-Mobile it'll be USA and then T-Mobile USA then it'll take you back to the settings and on the top right you're going to hit install from there hit reboot your phone so hold the top reboot it, turn it off, turn it back on then when it comes back on go back into Safari and go to the second mobile configs with the settings icon and hit create and enter in your internet settings for T-Mobile it should be either wap.voicestream.com or internet2.voicestream.com depending on your internet plan then you're going to hit install and after that is done it will take you back into Safari go home hit settings and then from there go to general network and then you will see internet tethering and you'll turn it on and you'll get the little blue bar at the top and the easiest way is just co to connect with USB and um, if you're on Vista once you plug it in it should just automatically install and set up on your PC and should take about two minutes at the max um, if you need more instructions um, they're on my blog like I said and uh, that should help there's step by step internet um, step by step to help you get the internet. Um, this works with T-Mobile Edge or um, AT&T um, 3G but I should warn you though on um, AT&T service I hear people um, if you use heavy usage of 3G um, you never know if uh, AT&T could suspend your account uh, since tethering is not allowed at this time. Um, also, I should have mentioned though at the beginning, this does not require a jailbroken iPhone. Um, just something that you go to Safari and set up. And um, like I said, that's how I'm connected right now via USB. So, hope you enjoyed this video. Follow me on Twitter, subscribe to my YouTube account, and I will see you guys later. Bye.